It is Perry Saturn against Mike Barton and Mike Barton's only appearance, uh, well, besides his only match. He doesn't appear after this. He's done. And honestly, like, one of the most underrated matches in TNA history. <laughs> just, the, just the shoot it fight. It is a legit shoot fight where they're just punching each other. They're doing suplexes. They're throwing each other into steps. They're bleeding. They're doing more suplexes. Like, this match has an, an amazing story. So... You have to go check it out, by the way. Like, if you're listening to this, yeah, go watch it. Go straight, right there. NWA TNA paper uh, number 40, April 9th. Yeah, 40. Go watch Mike Barton against Perry Saturn. So the story of the match is Mike Barton is wailing on Saturn. Saturn is bleeding. Saturn is struggling to compete. He's, like, falling all over the place. But every time Barton punches Saturn, Saturn's like, punch me again. And punch me again. And punch me again. Yeah. And eventually, yeah. Barton punches Saturn in the head so much that Barton breaks his own hand. Perry Saturn does a little hip toss, grabs the hand, wrenches it in the other direction. Breaks and, it. And Barton taps out immediately. So, like, the story of the match is it's that Saturn awesome. is so resilient that he had Barton punch him in the head so often until Barton broke his own hand and then tapped him out. And the, like, the submission finish is so sick looking to Oh, him. yeah, it does look like he literally wrenches his wrist in the other direction. It's like, oh, God. Even without the whole breaking yeah, hand context, is... that probably would have been a, like, a, a good submission finish. Yeah, this is tremendous. Because you don't get matches like this in TNA. You don't get like physical matches. You don't get shoot fights. But you also don't get matches that have that kind of deep like psychological story. The, you know, the, the Saturn literally willing him to punch him until he breaks his hand. You don't get that kind of lair mm. in a lot of these TNA matches. It's because like... You know, does Vince Russo give a shit about any of this kind of storytelling? No, so you just get tables and, and like, good X Division matches, to be fair. But the, the X Division matches are a very different kind of wrestling. Yeah, I was going to say, you know, they're really going out there trying to tell a full match-long story mm. either. They're just like, well, let's do some cool spots that are cool. Yeah, whereas these guys, it's like, we're, we're going to go out there, tell a story, and beat the shit out of each other. Which, what more do you want in pro yeah. wrestling? <laughs> it's basically it, right? I'm very disappointed Mike Barton never comes back. I kind of like it. It's like he's this legend <laughs> that just came about and left his mark and, you know, never was seen again. Mm. And it is. It's Saturn's best match in TNA, too. Definitely.